thunder, I hear words. You go on my page and you can listen to me and him have a conversation. All right? So, what do you understand about you being a Hebrew, uh, Mo? What do you understand? What you got to do? Like, like, you like, like, you like, 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 well, okay, Mo, but the Bible says that it's coming in time. He's got to put it in our inward parts. So you understand what I mean? That's the reason why the Bible says you got to thank you. Your mind. <laughs> you, got you, it. you got it. You yeah. must be re renewed in your mind. Satan can carry the book around all day. Yeah. False prophets and teachers and prophetess, disciples, men and women. You know, there was a female disciple in the Bible as well, right? They can carry, you know, the false ones. They can carry the book around all day. It's how you... How you honor the most high with your what? Mind, body, soul, spirit, and strength. You understand that? So that's what you got to do. It doesn't, it doesn't matter if you if you carry the Bible around all day. So what I said, it's about living it. Yes, living it. All right then. So I gave you two cities. You got to put down what kind of holidays now? Christmas. Why? Jeremiah 10th chapter tells you they were putting up a Christmas tree before Christ was even born. Luke, the second chapter, tells you he was born during the harvest. There was a prophetess by the name of Anna. She was prophesying the redemption of Christ uh, at the end. But she was a female prophetess and nobody wanted to hear. And guess what? 70 AD, the, the Messiah told them one stone is not going to be left upon another. They let the Romans come in there and slaughtered them. Now, we were already here over here, but we were still going off. And he still sent the Roman ego over here, all right, to kill us, all right.